One thing about breast, it's a three-dimensional structure and it requires a lot of understanding between the doctor and the patient. So I try to spend a lot of time with the patient analyzing their breast for them and also listening to them and seeing what they're expecting. How would their breast was 10 years ago, what they like to see today, bigger, smaller, lifted, not lifted. Different options always could exist and that involves using implants or just using lifts or doing a reduction or in breast cancer doing a reconstruction. I have uh, naturally large breasts and by the time I had contemplated surgery, I was about a 34 double H. Uh, the size of those breasts, the weight of that, left indentations on my shoulders, back discomfort, my neck sitting at the computer, even halter style swimsuits were really uncomfortable to wear. Um, it was just painful and I had waited a really long time to do it. I was afraid of the scarring and the discomfort and not until I met Dr. Sifi was I finally really comfortable to do it. I was unhappy with my breasts. My breasts were always a thing that, because I had smaller breasts and to fill in shirts, I kind of, you know, was looked down. I feel like I didn't feel sure and I didn't feel confident enough. We agreed that Dr. Saifi was going to go in and take out my old implants and replace them with new ones. Dr. Saifi uh, came in and he was so warm and just such a nice, nice person. He was very complimentary. He didn't try and tell me that I needed things done that I didn't feel that I needed done. I didn't feel like he was there to make a profit off of the fact that I had these humongous breasts I wanted to get rid of. I just felt like he really wanted to make me look like I wanted to look. My first consultation I did, because I had other family members who had gotten work done too, so I already knew the type of work that he did and I liked how it came out. So I was already feeling confident and like safe on the doctor I was coming to. So I kind of didn't have to worry about like whether he was a good doctor because I already knew he was. We also talked about doing a procedure where Dr. Saifi was going to uh, make my areola smaller to fit uh, the, the new size of what my breasts were going to be, which were smaller. Uh, so kind of just uh, to make them proportioned and perfect. Dr. Saifi knew exactly the right size for the areolas, the right size for the breasts. Dr. Saifi is an artist and he does amazing work. So my husband was very worried that he wouldn't like the outcome, uh, but quite to the contrary, he loves them and wishes that I did it even sooner. Uh, they look great and uh, I feel great. It changed my outlook completely about how I feel in clothing. I wish I had done it 20 years sooner, but then I wouldn't have had Dr. Saifi. So. I'm thrilled that I waited. He understood as far as the natural look that I didn't want it to look too crazy, too abnormal. Uh, very, I'm very proportional now, so I don't feel too flat up at the top because I'm not. And that's basically he, he did his job good. It's now been a few months since I've had my surgery and everything is looking wonderful and I feel great, things are fitting better, and my husband is happy because now I don't cringe when he touches my breasts because it used to hurt and now they feel fine. I would recommend Dr. Saifi any day, any time. He has the perfect bedside manner, he is an artist, he really listens to your needs and what you want while also suggesting what he thinks would be perfect.